this is our character that we have been picking. Hey, how's it going, bud? A lovely and beautiful man, as you can see. So we are going to be selecting him. Do the auto height and then play. And there we go. So we've got our axe and we have our torch and that's the only weapons we have. Like completely. No other weapons. <gasps> I've no I didn't have a look up here last time. Uh. Okay. Uh, I don't know how much money we have. Last time we got ourselves the crystal that allows us to uh, get the powers here, which we got all three of, as you can see. So we now have the ability to imbue. We have the ability to impact pulse. And we have the ability to... Uh, oh, f slow fall. As well as we now have gravity push as well. Which is obviously very helpful, because that allows us to then be able to do a bit more stuff, you see? We can't air jump, but we can float, which is cool. I've just realised something. There's no mana bar. Did they remove the mana bar? Because it used to be on your, like, wrist. Can I? Oh, yeah, I definitely cannot keep doing this. Maybe it's maybe it is just on a cooldown now. Cause sworn there used to be a mana system in this game. Anyway, so obviously we're gonna go to the bounty hunt first. We gotta go see our good old friend. I don't think I actually have anything that I can get off him at the current moment in time. I don't even know how much money I have. Um, we will look. Um, by the way, I'm gonna do a semi permadeath thing. Where. It's not a permadeath by any means. Welcome, like, stranger. oh yeah, I bought eggs last time, didn't I? Yeah. That didn't work too well either. Because I only got two of them. Which was a problem. But, never to fear. We also decked ourselves out and we look fucking good now. Now, I did see someone find a little Easter egg in this area. I think it's at the Baron's home sweet home over here. I think. Yes, it is. I didn't see this last time. I don't know how. No. Oh, wait. I might have to go to the... i got to quickly go over to the mi mirror and see if I can put this on. Ugh. We've got to have the Baron hat, right? Hasn't got a price tag on it. Can I try and buy it? I would like to buy, please. The red cloth over here is for purchases. Blue cloth for sales. Understandable. I mean, I attempted to buy it. If he's unhappy with that, he's unhappy with it. And there we have it, fellas. We got ourselves a captain hat. Fuck yeah. That's what I was looking for every time I go into the home. I'm just like, where's the captain hat? It's meant to be in here somewhere. But it's here instead with, obviously, the captain. The Baron, shall I say. So we're going to uh, Town Square. I mean, I like the idea of that, but we don't get a map piece from it. But I do want to try it out. We'll try it out for this one, and we'll do a outpost as well because I want to know what ha what what this is. If this is just kill thing. Okay. Okay. Woohoo! 
We got a wizard. Wizard. I want your sword. Give me this. Wizards. Woo -hoo 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 -hoo. Oh no, you don't. Huh? How do I use this? Yeah. Touch. Woo Oh, okay. I didn't think that was going to happen when I dropped that. Where's her sword? <laughs> I want this. Uh oh, Archer. Go, run. I love how none of them have brought shields out. I was really hoping one would. Wave two. That was wave one. I'm not a fan. Want the shield, want the shield, want the shield. If I can go get approached from all angles again. Come at me. Go for her first. Okay. Um. How about the? Well, I. Okay, we've got a couple of people on the staircase, that's fine, because we can just... So we got rewarded, we got some money, I don't know how exactly that worked or how much money I now have. How much money do I have? I now have 375, so that was actually kind of worth it, I'll be honest. Okay, so I might try and do those before, but what I was saying before 
with the kind of permadeath thing that I'm going to do is if I die, so for example I do this outpost here, okay, if I die during this outpost, I then have to try the outpost again but start with no weapons at all, okay, I have to sell all my weapons and try and do it without a weapon, okay, if I fail it then, then I have to restart the whole thing, okay, now obviously this could be a long series if I keep doing this because I could just keep failing which is likely because I'm terrible. Oh, we're here again. Oh, I recognize this area. We're going to sneak in this time. We got the axe. We got the torch. And we got the hat. Apart from that, we don't need anything else. So, I wonder if there's a statistic for how many people have stolen the Baron's hat. That's what I would like to know. Is what is the statistic of people that have stolen... The, the Baron's hat. Why can't I climb this hill, damn it? Why am I so inept? Okay, so. The plan is, is that we just Scooby-Doo our way on. Maybe we just don't do any of this. Maybe we just, you know, walk the plank over here. We jump on in. Ooh, maybe not Okay. Now we just scale this bit. Okay, so I don't know how we're planning to do this exactly. Okay. Not seeing anyone so far. Have a look around. I'm not seeing anyone as it stands so far. Oh, there's someone there. Someone just there. Oh, there's someone over there too. Attack! Fuck. <laughs> nice try, Bilbo. I heard someone else scream attack as well. Where? Can we get rid of the body at least? <laughs> They will never be able to identify you. Okay, let's uh, go up here slowly. Where's the boy that was digging around here? Where is he? Where'd he go? Oh, he's over there now. Okay. Ah. Motherfucker. Oh. If he's all the way over there, we can totally just, you know... Can I grab hold of any of those rocks? Yes, I can. Cool. Okay. Run in here, just quickly. Okay. Okay, here we go. I want to do some cool shit, you know? That's the plan. Cool shit. Cool shit comes first, okay? Because obviously each big dungeon is a three-part, which is cool. Because this is going to be like a 20-part series, essentially. If I don't fail it, ever. We have ourselves another egg, which we didn't have to pay for. That's always a bonus. Just like that. Hut! Oh, missed. We haven't actually beheaded anyone with this yet. There we go, that's what we wanted. We wanted a good beheading. I've turned off all of the mods, by the way, this time around. Oops, that was in his chest. There we go. Still got it. Even without mods, we can still behead people. That's fine. Uh. 
What's that? Oh, I heard someone shout attack. Sound like they drew a weapon as well. But I don't see anyone. Got some lore in here. Even though the druid of the North Clan travel. Yeah, yeah, not really that bold. I, I, I would like to know the law, but I also don't care that much. Cool. That'll be fine. My blade is red. Probably is. But you know what's not? Gravity. <laughs> this one has charge in it still. Um, not seeing any enemies right now. That little weird skull thing on my back keeps on pissing me off. Do we really want... We don't need that. We're going back up. Because I want to go up high. Because I want to know what's up there. Can I fit through the gaps? I don't think I can. However, I can definitely use this to... Scooch over a touch can I? Considering there was a ladder. Just that. Can I grab? Yes, I can grab hold of the rocks just there. Ooh, Ooh that was dodgy. Didn't feel like. Oh, there is a chest here. <gasps> Bank. Made my money's worth. Oh, well, don't put it in there then. I should really be scouring these places more because I'm just like. I've been rushing for a few of them for no reason at all. There's a guy down there. And I really shouldn't be rushing any of this area at all, just because of the fact that there's food, there's weapons, there's stuff that I can, you know, use, for, especially the food. Come on then, bitch. I'm here if you want me. Ow, you son of a bitch. I've got now a slightly smaller axe. Have a little look around. Should probably have a lit torch. There now, so nice. I can actually see into these like areas in here. See if there's anything of value. You know? <laughs> you never know when a bucket could just be full of apples or something like that. Light the candles as we go. Oh, never mind. Can't light the candles as we go. We're all burned out. Let's go. Oh fuck, he's got a bow. Got a bow. He's got a bow. I'll have my axe back, please. Yeah, hello to you too, bud. Hatchet works quite well. We don't normally have doors that open in this game. Ah, chest. Yet again, things like this is stuff I've got to look for when I'm doing this so that I can then pack my inventory full of ingots. Okay. So, let's continue on. Also got to keep an eye out for health items that could be around as well. Okay. 
Not seeing anything out here of value. No, nope, not seeing anything or anyone of value out here. <sighs> okay, now this is always a pleasure. This is. <sighs> nope, not that one. Come on. Perfect. See? Look at that. Look at that. That is what you call coordinated. Now, don't know why there's epic music playing. It's kind of slightly worrying, I'll be honest. Is that a free axe? It is. I love them. I do love them. That's actually slightly better than my current axe that I found. Yeah. Fuck yeah. We're going to make this one shiny purple to indicate it's mine. In case I throw it and it looks different. Now mind the infuse already worn off. Um, hello? That was worrying. That was like nearly full armor. That is... Oh wait, no, she's in green. I thought she was in male then. I was like, oh fuck. I'm in this kind of dungeon. I better not die here. I don't want to be fist fighting people in this dungeon. If it's got people in fucking male. Take your little dagger though. Fuck yeah, I will. Hate fucking archers. Oh god, this is an area that I don't. <laughs> this is an area and I don't want to spend too much time in because this is a wave area. <laughs> Try and nip through. Oh, we could just nip straight out. Not bother with it. How much loot do you think is going to be in here? There's got to be some, right? It's a wave area, for fuck's sake. Let's go. You First single-handed thing that we found, sword-wise. Good, good, good. Um, already in use, already in use. Do I need... Oh, the staff's already given up anyway. Fuck it, we're not using the staff then. I only had the ability to cast magic anyway. That I already couldn't do for my hands, so... Uh, stuff it. Ooh. Which way does she go? Does she change direction or does she just sit there? What do you think? Uh, she won't move. I think that's everyone. It's hard to tell. It's got to be most, if not all. Hasn't it? Eh? Can't see anyone else. I wonder if we did just kill. I wonder if there was only two people here. I was going to say, if not, I think I'm just about to be giving myself away. But we are having a quick look, but I do want to go up there, so... Might just be a case where I go the long way around. I think there's a long way around. Yeah, I think there was only two occupants, which is great. That's great news, because I generally thought I was going to be wave battling here, and I was like, oh no, I don't want to be doing that. You know what I mean? Does that go all the way from the bottom? Did I not have to do this at all? Could I have just gone from the bottom? And come up? Oh. Cool.
Yes, there is a chest up here. I thought there would be. See, it was worth killing the only other person here. <gasps> it's all good, okay? <gasps> we got a crystal as well from it. Hell yeah. We haven't actually collected up that many crystals this time around. Now we'll just slow fall down. As we gaze upon my new empire. Cool. I don't see anything else around here. Nothing of value. Problem is, because it's all stacked shelves and stuff like that, it's kind of hard to tell if there's anything of value on them and go kind of just force my way around. These brazers are loud. See, like, wooden chair gets picked up, piece of paper gets picked up, you see? Well, that's a lot of re writing. Too bad I'm not going to read it. We got that. Now, don't get me wrong, it's not because it's illegible in the VR headset. The graphics are great. It's just my inability of reading. I'm just not that great at reading, so I'd rather not struggle read. I've mentioned it in previous videos. Anyway, let's continue on through this dungeon. So, I know I can't sell the big rags. I've got to drop down there, but I feel like taking the stairs and the safer option is going to be the best, isn't it? For this because you want to be able to you know take on enemies one at a time rather than in a massive group but it looks like there's no enemies at oh did it say they were left for the day oh they're on about me that's nice uh, that's what we got oh Looks like gold. Not seeing anything of value yet again. I see a piece of paper. Your Majesty, I'm back from... Yeah, 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 yeah. Wherever you're back from, don't particularly care. Okay. Let's go. Okay. So this is a two... Oh, this is the end. Huh. Okay. Unless, of course, they're now going to jump scare me here by giving me false hope that this is the end. When it's actually not. But I feel like we've done really well. You know? I feel like we've done extraordinarily well. Although I do agree, I feel like there should be a black market seller that buys, like, skulls. You know, not for a lot of money, but just buys skulls. Got a goblet as well? Jesus Christ. Christ. Got so much. Look at it. We got so much cool shit. Okay. This is cool. Anyway, let's get the fuck out of here. And that means we will be saying goodbye to both little tiny sword and little tiny axe. I will be bidding you both farewell, I guess. And I will see you in another life. Cheers to them. Didn't even break the glass. Big sad. Wah. Whee. Away we go. Oh. How easy are you distracted? Oh. <laughs> and yeah. That's the dungeon done. As well. So I feel like that's plenty for this video. We have got now one. We will head to the Baron's Bounty just to... Because we have now a load of money, now that we've done that nighttime wave survival piece. Definitely didn't know what I was going into when I was doing that, so that's kind of cool, the fact that they've got that there. I did look at it in the last video and go, oh, I kind of want to do that, but I never actually done it. Now I have done it, and it's just like, okay, now I know where the bar is set. Okay. Let's see, how much money do we have? Good we have evening, 700 then. And that's before we've sold. Wait a minute, let's just sell everything real quick. Drop all valuables. We have 80 invaluables. Sell that motherfucker. We have 830 right now. We have 830 right now. Why do we have a basket? Oh, it's the basket that the eggs were in. Ah, yeah. I, I know why we have a basket. Don't worry. I, 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 figured, I figured it out. 
I figured it, I figured it, I figured it out. Wah. Fireball! Da -da 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 -da. Uh, hey, uh, um. Yeah. Uh, you not got any like I don't know new stuff in lately? No, not not a thing. I literally bought the only good weapon you've got. I think. That's, I don't know. Maybe I want that short sword. Maybe I do want the short sword, you know? Maybe I do want a backup short sword. Just have there, you know, just a pa pa. Sink a little bit faster, you know? Don't get me wrong, I still obviously love the axe. Or do I get a dagger? Is there a, like, good dagger kicking out? Yeah, I will. Just, I'm just deciding still, because... We got a meat cleaver that's pretty cool. But we also have this dagger here. I feel like I could, you know, sneak up and kill people with it. But then again, if I'm just using it for assassinations, should I go for that or should I just go with a simple, you know, yeah, just... Nah, I'm going for the dagger. The dagger's a little bit more... You know? I feel like that's a good purchase right there. Anyway, you'll see me using that. In the next video. Was close encounters. To be that? honest with you, I would have sold that for less. Now I don't get. I want to check check something. If I put that there, there's no option to Man, buy it see? for less. There's no option to buy it for less. I despise you. Because <laughs> that's the second thing I bought, and he's like, "I would sell that for less," and I'm just like, "Oh, would you? Shit, I should have bought it for less." I need trousers, that's what I need. I haven't bought myself a good pair of trousers yet, have I? I'm still in the rags I started off with. But with these... Yeah. These are definitely trousers though, aren't they? They're not... Yeah, these are definitely trousers. I can feel them bumping. Problem is, because they don't tell you what they are, until I put them up there. Look, there we go. Get a better price than that. Not this side of the cabinet see. There we go. Cool. Look at that. Now we're a complete set. God damn. Okay. Now we are a complete set. Now I am gonna buy, I think, some apples. Ooh. Pick them up. Take them over. How many of these can I purchase? Like, not the well, 126. Five. The ocean. Great. Will there be anything else? Ah, my apples. Luckily, they don't burst on the floor like eggs do, though. I won't be making that mistake again. I'm buying apples from now on. Keep your basket. Wait a minute, he hasn't got his hat on. I thought he had his hat on. I've actually stolen his hat. I suppose he's not trying to kill me. So you got the health potions. The problem is that I don't see the point in a health potion right now, you know? Like, yeah, glug glug. But why? Why would I need to glug glug? We've got the level 1 stuff and that's about it. Anyway, I think that'll do for this video. Catch me next time where I do another dungeon. It'll be another shorter one. Uh, I'm wondering if you guys want me to do two a week or whether or not you're happy with the one a week. Because realistically I'm recording these way ahead of time at this point. Because I love this game. I love this game a lot. Like, so much. That one's the one that's got the most money out of it. <laughs> okay, so that's the one we'll be doing next. Anyway, I'll catch you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.